is. I like the mech um, BKB build on the SF and we go Ags on the Queen of Pain. I think, like, uh, an Ags first would be... Uh, Rocket Barrage with the right oh, amount of body blocking. Big match in the Oh, man. Go to some fun. Might just die here. A couple more right clicks underneath the tower, and they got it. First blood goes to Loda. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Yeah, he might... Probably gonna go... That's four. Uh, they're, they're making fully sure that there's no escape. They close down all avenues for Jonas Afan. He tries to go on the right-hand side. TPs are coming in, but he will be controlled enough that will be going down. Still, the vision block is there. S4 is in a peck of trouble here. More TT coming out. Lin tries to pop him, but no. He instantly gets blown up. Now, S4 bottling up, turns around on a seal kid. Will be able to get that kill as well. Alliance just come back strong here and take easily the team fight in this bottom tier. But something just randomly broke. Apparently, midway through the cast. Alliance are breaking everything. Just breaking everything. I guess so. Air is going to be jumped on by S4. They're going to try and blow him up immediately. Uh, Limp responds, and they're actually going to be looking at S4, looks like, with a combination of ultimates, BKB, Popeye, Era, and they're actually staying alive through this. Hanskin's going to go down. Era trying to get away. He does have a TP, but his BKB is fade, and now he has to turn and fight. Will go down to Loda. Triple kill for him. All in exchange for S4. Looks like you know some fun. Last not. Just give him all the runes he ever wanted to his life, and he'll be happy. He's got 2,400. Yeah, he'll probably go for the to next, and... They don't even need it at this point. So they don't really have the greatest initiation right now. Twelve Earth Shaker to be only at level six to twenty-five minutes. Holding the high If the uphill push, if you wanted to make it even easier for yourself, you'll make sure that the Winter Wyvern is dead first. Sure enough, that's exactly what the Invis rune does for him. You kinda have to hold now. You have to wait for the Wyvern to come back up. Which will give probably enough time for Alliance to take this tier 3 tower. They've got enough damage. S4 is actually going to jump in, go for Era. Still has that BKB, and they're not actually threatening him enough. They just push him back while the rest of the team focuses on the objectives. Tier 3 is down, another two seconds until the Winter Wyvern's back up. And they get an initiation here. Nages the Pajamas. Still looking for that opening. They managed to get a Fisher block on S4. Good start. Limp is going to try and blow him up, but has already been stunned up. And actually, Lotus damage is coming in big. He's going to have to blink away from this one. No opportunity for a Sonic Wave. They lose the racks and don't even get anything. Now they manage to get the vacuum off, but it's only on two. Sonic Wave is not fighting up. S4 ready to go with the turn, and Loda is just fighting up against Era. Now the ultimate gets dropped on top of that one. Echo Slam gets laid out, but it's never going to be enough. Double kill for Loda, and he's looking for a triple in the hands of Era. Goes for a quad. Seal Kid trying to get away back to the fountain, but won't escape. Ultra kill for Loda. Now the buybacks occur. Nip, desperate to continue to force this fight, but S4 managed to get himself away. Will be sent back to base. Now an Orchid. Yule Scepter is response. Queen of Pain going for the blink out. Blink away. No, Rampage for Loda. He keeps on going. Era's going to try and take away that Aegis, but GG well played. Nip, they didn't stand a chance. Yeah. Ever since the around the 15 minute marker, this was always going to be a very one-sided game. They tried to wait for Alliance to make a mistake, but the new Alliance just don't make those. Yep, that was great. Great play all around from Alliance from start to finish. Just bled the enemy dry. Just punished for their greedy lineup. I mean, Wyvern's good if you can get the combos.